Hi there, I'm John from VPN Mentor. Welcome to our tutorial and review of ExpressVPN. We're going to see if they're as fast as they promise. I'm going to check their support and I'm going to save your time of installing them and paying them so you can see for yourself if they are good or not. So ExpressVPN is the fastest VPN we tested. It's ultra secure and easy to use. Let me show you how it works. First, select a plan that works for you. There's a one month plan for $12.95 a month, or a 12 months plan, that's $8.32 a month, or the six months plan, that's $9.99 a month. With the one month plan and the six months plans, there's a 30 day money back guarantee. But for the 12 month plan, there's a 45 day money back guarantee. I'm gonna go for the one month plan. There's a trick for getting three months for free on VPN Mentor. Just go to vpnmentor.com forward slash blog forward slash best dash VPN dash deals and click the link on the page that will get you the three months free. It's quick and easy to subscribe. You just enter your email address, select your preferred payment method. You have many options to pay. You can pay by credit card, Visa, MasterCard, American Express, as well as others. You can even choose Bitcoin for anonymous payment. As you can see, for this review, I've chosen PayPal for convenience. Once you've subscribed, it's time to secure your account. Express gives you an automated password, but you can create your own, which we recommend. But let's continue here with this password for convenience. Once the password's validated, you'll be taken to a page where you can start the setup. You'll get an activation code, but you don't have to save it. They can email it to you again if you forget it. So let's click on the download and see how this setup goes. The installation is pretty quick. As you can see, this OS is pretty old, but Express works perfectly and it's fine. Now that the installation's completed, let's start. Now just paste the activation code you previously saved in this field and click OK. This will activate ExpressVPN. OK, success. Let's take a look at the app. You can change location here and we'll take a look at the options. Under help, you have the support website or contact us. You can also view diagnostics or save diagnostics. Here's what a log looks like. And this is where you get the 30 days free. It's really quick and easy to use and a nice design. Other VPNs have a map you can simply click on the country. I like it better than the list view that Express has, but maybe it's just me. This app looks as good on your mobile device as it does on your personal computer. You get 30 days for free, and they guarantee you'll be reimbursed if you decide to cancel. Here's where I find out what my IP address is. Right now, it's localized in Romania. I'm running a quick speed test to see what it is. This is not through ExpressVPN. And of course, the speed results you'll see depends on your internet provider. So it looks like I'm gonna get about 17 megs down and about 19 megs up. That's pretty good. I'll do one last test. Let's see if we can access the BBC from here. The content's not available. It's not successful. We're not in the UK. So let's see if we change our location. See if that'll work. Now back to the VPN. So I can search by a country or city by typing, or you can even choose from your favorite. But it's a little easier to just click and choose Europe, the United Kingdom, and London. Now we're connecting. Okay, the VPN's on. Now that I've chosen the UK, let's see about the BBC. There it is. It works. The connection is fast and easy. 
Now with the IP test, you can see it's well hidden. It's located in the UK and no leak. You're secured. Let's try the speed test. Express is considered the fastest VPN. Let's take a look at this. Let's check it out. Looks like we're getting about 8 megs down. And 13 megs up. It's pretty good. Even though these results are not as good as without VPN, they're still decent and will allow you to watch on streaming without buffering. One last test. We're going to test the reactivity of Express support. Let's try to find a movie on Netflix. I'm now in Romania, so when I search, I only have access to the Romanian Netflix catalog. It's not found. Let's see if we can get access to the entire Netflix catalog. You can contact support directly via the app. It's easy and practical. I'll contact support and tell them that I can't find a movie on Netflix that I know is there. After a few hours, I get this answer. They've told me how to connect to the US Netflix by choosing a different location. Click on the Americas, the United States, and Washington DC too. Now the VPN's on. Let's go back to Netflix to see if I can find the movie I was looking for. Because I have the VPN on, I should now have access to the US Netflix catalog, which is supposed to be the fullest one. Now when I search for the movie, it's available. Here it is. If you're curious, Kill Switch is a movie about internet censorship and control. One last thing, let's unsubscribe and get a refund. Unsubscribing is fast. Just click the link. Let's ask them how long it'll take before I'll get a refund. You just have to fill out a simple form, provide your info here, name and email, then choose your OS and type whatever message you want. I'll ask for my money back, mention the 30 days money back guarantee, and thank them. Once again, my question is answered quickly and the refund is guaranteed within a week. Great job, Express. Thanks for listening. If you appreciated our video, please share, like, or comment below.